I start vlogging and you run over. I don't know why. Like, she hears the camera and she just runs over. Well, this is a lot of stuff in the middle of the floor here. I don't know what's up with that, yeah. A trash bag? Trash bag. Cat. Books. Papers. Memories. <laughs> Teaching stuff, paper that I wadded up and threw over there because it made me mad. <laughs> it's a lot of stuff. As you can see, I'm trying to clean out some. Trying to. I've managed to clear out one container. I still have more here in front of me. And a couple more in the office. And then there's maybe one more under the bed. And it's just, it's memories from, there's some from high school a lot from college, both colleges that I went to. And then a lot of classroom stuff. Cause you know, I was gonna be a teacher. Well, I was a teacher, somewhat. I just decided not to <laughs> further that career. And I didn't think much about it when I started this task this morning. I kind of knew that I was a little bit emotional today, but I might have broken down and cried at least four times <laughs> while I'm doing this. And I'm doing it now, what? <laughs> I don't know, it's just, it's like, it's just like, you know, old dreams are just whacking me in the face here. And I'm getting angry about it and I'm about to just throw all of it away. <laughs> I'm not gonna do that. I would like to throw away a good bit of it, but I'm stinking attached to it. Because I mean, the parts that have me emotional or not, all the hard work for from college. But yet, that stuff is still hard for me to get rid of as well, because, I mean, that was a lot of blood, sweat, and tears that I poured into those projects. Like I have Anna's book and poetry file. And there's just, it was busy work, it was obnoxious. <laughs> but I had to go and like, read all these books, these kids books, and then write a little summary about each one. So I have, I have so much just crap, <laughs> but yet I can chunk this. Like, I don't even think it was, that would be beneficial to me if I was in a classroom, but yet it's hard for me to just throw it away. Another one that I like, don't really have a reason to keep, except for it's amazing, and I got an A plus on it, <laughs> is this biology three notebook that I had to do and I had to like classify I had to go around and take pictures all of these is pictures that I have taken <laughs> and then I had to classify it each in the kingdom it was crazy stuff I don't necessarily need this but I don't want to chunk it either anyway I'm gonna figure out what I should keep and textbooks do I chunk my textbooks I have thrown some away. Um, anyway, really what has me so emotional is, you know, once I figured out that I maybe didn't want to be in a classroom teaching, I knew in my heart though that I would be um, homeschooling our kids one day. And so I saved all of this because A, there, I mean, I didn't, I might, I might go back and teach one day, I might. But really, I think all along I knew I just really wanted to be a homeschool mom. I just really, and I want to do it for myself. Like, I love, like, teaching kids. And then I discovered I don't like teaching other people's kids. I just want to teach my own kids. <laughs> so then I kept all this for, you know, when we had kids. And I would homeschool them. And I'd have, I'd be so far ahead on all of, the, like, the curriculum and stuff. Because I had a ton of it. Had a ton of it for kindergarten, <laughs> past kindergarten and first grade, I have to start buying stuff. But anyway, and so it's just, it's, it's hurts my heart this morning that, you know, three years, still no kids, <laughs> but it's okay. <laughs> just so much stuff. <laughs> I think I'm just gonna go to a park and just walk. I need to run anyway. That's what I'm gonna do. <laughs> oh, Thursday. Happy Thursday, everyone. Okay, I'm composed. 
and I'm just I'm able to talk freely now. Um, I didn't mention why. I don't think I mentioned why I'm doing this, and it's just because I have too much. Like no one needs six containers under their bed full of teaching stuff and memories and textbooks. Like no one needs that. And there's no reason for me to really keep a lot of it. I'm gonna keep some. So that's why I'm just kind of trying to weed out. I just felt like I needed to clarify. If I didn't need to clarify, then oh well. But yeah, I need to get this at least moved so that when Rainy comes home tonight, he's not like, what happened? What'd you do today? Except move containers to the middle of the living room and left them. We're getting our sidewalk blown off. That's what that is. I'm not about to be attacked by a monster. Okay, I was able to clear out two of them. That's progress, right? I am impressed that I did clear out two. So there's a little bit more room. Minimum amount. Well, I decided to come to a park and I have my nice little area <laughs> and I'm just gonna sit here and chill. I'm going to just be alone with God for a bit and just soak in the sun as well and admire the water. I really just can't seem to go wrong with this situation. So yeah. some loud kids running around the park. I think they're doing maybe after school. I don't know. I don't think it's a sports team. There was a football team here earlier running, but this is like a different group. Anyway, they're really loud and I thought I was going to wait for them to finish their run and then I would run. But one of them loudly just remarked that they still have 20 minutes left of their run. That is a pretty good run. They are probably in sh good shape because they've already been running for like 15. So anyway, I have enjoyed my time out here. Did some reading, did some coloring. <laughs> Fun adult coloring books. Anyway. leave my spot now. I need to get my run in and head home. But I needed this. It was really good and I feel better. So, good. <laughs> good place. You were lovely. And view, you weren't too shabby either. Okay, finished my run. That was hard to do, I think because of the wind. Like I need, I need to train in all types of weather. So that's why I wanted to do it outside today. But man, it really hurts your lungs. And that wind was probably nothing. Like, I mean, some some places get a lot of wind. And we only get wind a little. Bit. I don't know what I'm saying. I don't know. That hurt. But it was good. I'm glad I did it. Yeah, I'm going to go home and clean up those containers. Because I didn't do that before I left. 
I just want to sit here for a minute. Okay, we can go now. Oh, goodbye, park. I enjoyed my time here with you. My 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 several hours with you. You were good to me. Goodbye. found trash bags full of Anna's memories <laughs> and and I was just like oh my goodness what happened and she told me and I was just like oh man that's just kind of crazy but I'm glad that I'm home and after a little bit of consoling and understanding Anna is on the floor doing stretches I am I'm doing cat cow cat cow which is aptly named because Roland's right there he is all over me yeah I actually can't do it. And he's like, Mama, you're not a cat. Don't even try. Anyway, uh, after my run, my back just started hurting more. I've been stretching it out tonight. But not doing the stretches on the ground. Can't lay flat or I get stuck. It's what every 27 year old dreams of, really. <laughs> <laughs> not Easy. being able to lay flat. <laughs> I really need to get you a chiropractor. I'm going to make an appointment next week. Good. After our, we get paid. Woo, paycheck. Raise the roof. <laughs> so normally we have an ornament there. It's right here. Why is it right there? I'm gonna, I think, pop some popcorn in a bit, and I'm gonna watch a movie. I'm okay. gonna watch a chick flick. That sounds great. You can help me decide because you'll probably be in here working or editing. Yeah. So you, you can help me. I'm not gonna just be like, Pride and Prejudice. Bam. You have no say. You have. What is the line? You have bewitched me. You have bewitched Body me. And soul. Body and soul. <laughs> Love handles! <laughs> That's from our marriage conference. Yeah. Anyway. So good. Anyway. Anyway. I don't know what movie we'll watch, but I'm going to pick one. And I'm going to watch it. And it's going to be grand. And I'm going to use that beautiful blanket and just snuggle up on our broken couch. Yeah, it's still broken. And it's still, it'll, it'll be forever broken <laughs> until we get a new one. Yeah. <laughs> anyway. It's going to be a good night, though. Good it is Thursday gonna be a good night. night. Yeah. It and is. I'm going to just welcome in. Friday that way. Today was kind of a weird day at work. I got stuck doing this one thing over and over again and it just wouldn't fix itself. I mean, when I say fix itself, I couldn't fix it properly and there kept being issues with it. There kept being issues with it and I just got really annoyed and frustrated with it and I think uh, it just reminded me of how like this part of programming is not what I want to do and that's stuck with old technology so it makes me happy that our company is trying to focus on new technology Ooh. but i'm home now so i think i'm going to uh try and get a jump start on editing and roland is going to meow somewhere over there he wants to vlog of course he does what do you have to say bud is that so <laughs> <laughs> is that how you you felt you look like Sam Pepper being out of focus. <laughs> First half of the video. <laughs> First half of the video. You smell really funny. Have you bathed yourself lately? Probably not. <laughs> well, boundaries. Boundaries. <laughs> boundaries, y'all. Boundaries. <laughs> Back off now. You humans. Hey guys, we are going to go to bed. Uh, say a prayer for Anna. Her back is really hurting her. She said it's the worst that it's ever been. She's actually kind of having some issue just walking, but thank you for your prayers. Hope you guys have enjoyed this vlog. If you have, hit that thumbs up. Leave a comment down below. Talk to you guys soon. God bless.